today's rough study of realities, written by Pastor Chris Oyahilome, Saturday, 18th July 2020. Conquer yourself. For what shall it profit a man if he or shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? Mark chapter 8, verse 36 to 37. Throughout history, there have been hundreds of well known leaders who subdued other men. The whole world was subject to them. They had everything under their tyranny. Some were even so revered and placed by others in the class of God. But Jesus said, For what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? Mark chapter 8, verse 36 to 37. Never pride yourself in your ability to subdue or dominate others. Rather, learn to use your authority over yourself. Conquer yourself. That's when you really win. When you say to yourself, I'm going to do the right thing and say the right thing only and keep at it. When your words and actions are under your charge, consciously subject to God's world, then you are ready for true success. When you tell yourself, nothing filthy will come out of me, and consciously ensure such a lifestyle true the world that's the way of victory. Refuse to give vent or expression to satanic manifestations such as anger, hatred, bitterness, jealousy, and envy. Be sure that only the blessings, grace, and compassion of Jesus are seen and experienced by everyone around you. Make the choice that only His love and works of righteousness will effuse from you to your world. Prayer Blessed Father, I thank you for the blessing privilege to receive your world. My mind is stayed on your world. The spirit of excellence at work in me brings discipline and stability into my life to produce fruits of righteousness and manifest your love in Jesus' name. Amen. For the study. First Corinthians chapter 9, verse 25 to 27. Proverbs chapter 25, verse 28. Proverbs chapter 16, verse 32. Meditate on these words. Give yourself wholly to them, that your profiting may appear unto all. Have a blessed day.